Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation, which is 9 raised to power a minus 3 raised to power a is equal to 702. So here, first of all, we will change this 9 to its exponential form, 3 raised to power 2 or 3 square. So this equation will become 9 is same as 3 raised to power 2 whole raised to power a minus 3 raised to power a is equal to 702. Then the next step we will interchange these two powers. We will change the position of these two powers. So this will become 3 raised to power a whole square minus 3 raised to power a is equal to 702. Look to the left hand side, there is 3 raised to power a, there is also 3 raised to power a. So here we will make a supposition. Let us suppose this 3 raised to power a is equal to, let 3 raised to power a is equal to x. So in next step we will replace 3 raised to power a with x in this equation. So this will become, implies, it will become x square minus x is equal to 702 next we will take this number to the left hand side so this will become x square minus x minus 702 is equal to 0 so this is a quadratic equation it cannot be solved using factorization method so here we will use the quadratic formula and we will try to find the roots of this quadratic equation so for quadratic formula we need the value of a b and c so from here we will write the values of a b and c the value of a is 1 the value of b is minus 1 and the value of c is minus 702 and the quadratic formula for the variable x is minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a now here we will substitute the values of a b c from here in this quadratic formula so this will become x is equal to minus b the value of b is minus 1 plus minus square root of b square minus 1 square minus 4ac value of a is 1 and the value of c is negative 702 divided by 2 times 1 now next it will become x is equal to negative time negative is positive so it will become positive 1 plus minus square root of minus 1 square is 1 and here negative times negative is positive 4 times 2 is 8 4 times 0 is 0 and 7 times 4 is 28 so the product of these two numbers gives him 2808 divided by 2 next we can write this as x is equal to 1 plus minus square root of the addition gives him 2809 divided by 2 now next we can write this number inside the square root as 1 plus minus square root of this 2809 can also be written as 53 square divided by 2 so here this square and square root will be cancelled so only 53 will be left here so it will become x is equal to 1 plus minus 53 divided by 2 so there are two values of x one is positive one is negative so they are 1 plus 53 divided by 2 and the second value is x is equal to 1 minus 53 divided by 2 so let's simplify these two numbers 6 is equal to 53 plus 1 is 54 divided by 2 which is equal to 2 times 1 is 2, 2 times 27 is 54. 
so this will become 27 and here x is equal to 1 minus 53 is minus 52 divided by 2 2 times 1 is 2 2 times 26 is 52 so it will become minus 26 so here we got two values of x one is 27 and the second is minus 26 now here in this problem we need not to find the values of x here we need to find the value of a so to find the value of a we will come to our supposition that is x is equal to 3 raised to power a so from here we will find the value of a now the last two values of x are x is equal to 27 and the second value is x is equal to minus 26 and here we will replace x with its value that is 3 s to power a so this will become 3 s to power a is equal to 27 and here 3 s to power a is equal to minus 26 and here first we will solve this one equation here 3 raised to power a is a number in exponential form so for any number for any real number a 3 raised to power a is always positive but here in the right hand side it is a negative number minus 26 so a positive number cannot be equal to a negative number so that's why here we will reject this one solution we will only solve this one equation for the value of a so next we can write this equation as 3 raised to power a is equal to we can also write 27 as 3 raised to power 3 now here the bases are same so we will compare the powers so the powers are a is equal to 3 so a is equal to 3 is one of the possible solution and root of this nice exponential equation now here we will check that a is equal to 3 is the correct root of this exponential equation or not so we will verify it here let's verify now to verify it we will rewrite the exponential equation here which is 9 s to power a minus 3 s to power a is equal to 702 now here the value of a is 3 so this will become 9 s to power 3 minus 3 s to power 3 is equal to 702 now 9 s to power 3 is the multiplication of 9 3 times so 9 times 9 is 81 and 81 times 9 is 729 minus 3 s to power 3 is 3 times 3 is 9 9 times 3 is 20 7 is equal to 702 now the subtraction of these two numbers gives him 702 is equal to the right hand side 702 now since both sides are equal so it means that a is equal to 3 is the exact and correct root of this nice exponential equation and last, if you like this video, so don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.